Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make an image effect very easy in After Effects. Here I have my original clip and a second clip that I'm going to use as an image in a frame. Now first of all select your clip that you are going to use as an image and press S on your keyboard to open scale and then make the clip smaller. Now toggle it off for a while and then select your main clip, now go to tracker and click on track camera. As the analyzing is done and in case if you will have that issue with 3D tracker, don't worry, let me show you a quick fix. Change shot type to specify angle of view and then increase horizontal angle of view to 30. Now wait until it's solving camera and as you see it's fixed and we have tracking points on a video. So now let's select some point on the car and then right click and select set ground plane and origin. Right click again and select, create solid and camera. Select your second clip now and move it above track solid and toggle it on. Right click on that layer, then go to layer styles and select stroke. Expand stroke settings now and change color to white. Increase the size until you are happy with it. Now change position to inside and as you see we have the cool photo style on our video but, let's make it look more realistic. I will increase the size a bit more. Now make sure none of the layers are selected and then grab a rectangle tool and draw a shape like this. Make sure that the fill is set to solid and the color is white, and now it looks more like a photo from a Polaroid camera. Play around with the settings if needed and then let's track that image with our video. But before, make sure to pre-compose shape layer and a photo layer into a one layer. I will name it to frame and make sure move all attributes is selected and then hit OK. Now link it to a track solid and enable 3D on frame layer. Press S on your keyboard and scale it until you are happy with it, then correct X, Y, and Z rotations and also position it where you want it to be. Let's check it if it's tracked perfectly. Once you are satisfied, make sure to toggle off track solid and then let's make that image layer behind the car. Duplicate your main clip and move it above frame layer and then delete 3D camera tracker on it. Now select a roto brush tool and double click on duplicated layer. Rotoscope the car as smooth as possible now. Once you are done, click on freeze button. As the freezing is done, go back to composition. And the image effect is ready. I will move it down a bit and we are done. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.